In today's video, I'm going to teach you how you can install Google Gemini on your Mac in a couple of easy steps. The first thing we're going to do is launch Google Chrome on our Mac and then head over to gemini.google.com. So we're just heading over to gemini.google.com. And then from here, we're going to sign in. You can either sign in by using the sign in button in the bottom left or the bottom right hand corner and then sign in with your Google account. We're going to go next. If you have two-factor verification, sign in with two-factor and then go continue. Once you've signed into gemini.google.com, what we're going to do on Google Chrome is in the top right-hand corner, we're going to select on the ellipses here and we're going to scroll down to just above the bottom, the fourth tab from the bottom where it says save and share. And then we're going to select on the third option from the top called create shortcut. We're simply going to select on create shortcut here. The dialog box is going to pop up and ask us to create a shortcut. You can rename this anything you like, but I think keeping it as Gemini or even Google Gemini makes sense. And then we're going to select the button of open as a new window and then simply select on create. When we hit create, what you'll see here is that the app opens up in a brand new window in the top left hand corner of your Mac. It no longer says Chrome, but it says Google Gemini or what, what we've named it as. And in the bottom in the dock here, you can see you have Google Gemini as well. You can now right click and then you can go in the option section and you can choose to keep this in the dock, open it, login and even show it in finder. So if I select on keep in dock, I can now move it and have Google Gemini docked in my uh, dock at the bottom. And if I go into all my applications in my launch pad, you even see here we have Google Gemini installed as well. So it's really easy. One caveat, of course, so being in AI, it does need to run and have, uh, does need internet to be to run. Uh, but we've installed it here really quickly and really easily. If you wanted to uninstall Google Gemini from your Mac, you cannot actually drag and drop it as you would a normal application. And you won't find it in the application section either. The easiest way to uninstall it is actually going into the top right hand corner of your Mac and opening up the spotlight search, typing in Chrome app, and then this will take you to the folder where all your Chrome apps live. And you'll see we have Google Gemini here. So we can now right click on it and then go move to bin. And that would remove Google Gemini from your computer. In a couple of seconds, it will remove from my dock at the bottom and of course from my uh, launch pad as well and it is that easy to install google gemini on your mac of course if you like this video let me know by giving the thumbs up and if you want to supercharge your computer hit that subscribe button as well thanks for watching and see you next time bye